a pecan crusted pork tenderloin crostini with a strawberry balsamic sauce. How Good. delicious does Perfect. that sound? So yeah. we've gotten our fruits in today. We've had our mango, and right. now we're gonna get some strawberries. <laughs> so just come down here, Donna. Okay. I've got two eggs right here. If you would scramble those up, please. Okay. And I'm gonna pull our pork tenderloins out of the drawer. Look how delicious Yum. those look. Here, I'm gonna right sit here. that right there. Great. And I'm gonna come in here and I'm gonna mix one cup of breadcrumbs. And these are just store-bought breadcrumbs and these are not seasoned. Okay. You know, I don't I always buy the plain because I find sometimes yes. the seasoned crumbs are too salty and then you yeah. can't salt your food. Right. And you may not want to carry it the way that that's right. been that's seasoned. Right. Because we're we're gonna we're gonna have a nice little sweet flavor to mm, this yeah. because That'll be really I'm nice. gonna add a fourth of a cup of brown sugar. And here's the secret ingredient. Look at these pecans. Oh, my. They have been through the food processor. How'd you do that, girl? Food processor, That's honey. That's beautiful. And I'm going to use about half of this, which will probably yield about a cup, a cup? of these ground pecans. Oh, it smells. And, mm, mm. Nice. And a little salt. And pepper. A little pepper. Yum. All right, now you beat up your eggs, put them in there. Okay. And I'm going to add. You want me to just roll these in the? Yes, yes. And then I've got some ground red pepper, about a half a teaspoon. Wow. And that's gonna give it just a little bitty bite. And those are two one pound tenderloins, Donna. And I'm just gonna mix it up with my hands to make sure it all gets mixed up good. And I've got a pan over here, Donna, that I've lined with tin foil. Okay. And we're gonna just lay it right there, girl, and okay. I'm gonna rub and roll this meat in all those wonderful That's ingredients. That's beautiful, yeah. And you know, the thing I love about pork tenderloins is you can have your entree done so quickly. So now that's gonna go in this oven, y'all. We've got it preheated to 375 degrees in 18 or 20 minutes. We're going to have these pecan encrusted beautiful. pork tenderloins that are going to melt in your mouth. That's beautiful. Our entree for our meal today, our little garden soiree party we got going on. Yeah. We got the tenderloin in the oven. And tell everybody what you're fixing to make. I am going to make a topping for a crostini that we're going to have with the pork. We're going to use some thyme, fresh thyme some fresh chives, uh -huh. some cream cheese, and some mayonnaise. This is gonna be amazing because the cream cheese, mayonnaise, and these fresh herbs are gonna be fabulous with this pork. And I am preparing two cups of diced fresh strawberries because I'm gonna make the strawberry sauce to eat along with our pork. So you've got an eight ounce package of cream, cream cheese. cheese at room temperature. Yes. Oh, you're gonna add a little mayonnaise too. Mm -hmm. Yay! Yeah, girl. This party is looking better <laughs> already. Now I'm getting my two cups of strawberries okay. into my pot. And to my pot, I'm gonna add two tablespoons of sugar and two tablespoons of a Wonderful balsamic vinegar. Mm, that smells so And then so we're gonna good. let this cook, Donna, for about five minutes. We're just gonna let it reduce. Okay. Now I'm gonna add the thyme. Okay. Two tablespoons of fresh okay. thyme. Smells delicious. How about your chives? And not yet. Those will be easy. Okay. What else you got going in here? Um, salt just and pepper. Your, okay. <laughs> Yum. That's starting to reduce and thicken mm. up. So, well, let's finish up our pork tenderloin. I told y'all that I was gonna thicken the strawberries, the sugar, and the balsamic vinegar. I used a fourth of a cup of chicken stock and two tablespoons of cornstarch, and I got that nice and thick. Mm -hmm. And Donna, you can start taking out our little pies. All right, now I'm gonna start working on oh our pork tenderloin crostinis. Look at this pork tenderloin. Oh my gosh, that's and gorgeous. Y'all remember 
that they're encrusted with pecans. Ooh. Yum. Mm. So let's get these underway. We've already toasted and buttered our bread. Now all we're gonna do is put a little of that wonderful cream cheese that you did. Yum. And we're gonna put arugula. Pork. Pork. A little of our sauce. A little fresh berries, if you like. Yum. There you go. And if you wanted to, Donna. Oh, a sprig of thyme. You could put a little sprig of thyme All on right. it. But I don't have time for the thyme. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yum, girl. I love to cooking with you. To my friend, Donna. Mmm. 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 Mm-hmm. Oh, it's so good. Isn't it delicious? The cream oh. cheese. Oh, with it's, the... it's so good. Thank mm -hmm. you.